Hey, welcome back to another Morales video. My name is Bharat and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can use Morales APIs to fetch the wallet profit and loss in just one API call. So let's get started. So I'm just going to start with a quick walkthrough of Morales devs. And as you can see right here, Morales devs is the crypto data platform. So if you're a dev building your web three application, Morales devs provides you with APIs infrastructure to basically accelerate your time to market. And Morales devs contains APIs across NFTs, token data, DeFi data, wallet data, etc. So you can basically see and go through our docs to understand how you can leverage all our APIs to accelerate your time to market. So you also have real time streams, you have market insights, essentially it's powering a wide range of users and a lot of applications right now. So if you want to get started, you can just click on login and that's going to take you to your Morales devs dashboard. And as you can see right here, you have data about your compute unit usage. You can see your API key, you can see your docs, tutorials, etc. And all you need for this particular video is to just take your API key and then you can head to our docs. So once you're in the docs, you can basically see about what APIs are supported by Morales. And in this video, we need to go over the wallet PNL. So we're going to go into wallet and you can go into PNL. So you have two APIs right here. And the first one's basically to get the wallet PNL summary. And let's basically see what it does. So as you can see right here, this is going to retrieve the profit and loss for a given wallet address. And it's going to give you the total trades, the total trade volume, the total profit USD that's realized, total realized profit percentage. And also it's going to tell you about the total buy and sell and also the total sold volume and the total bought volume. So if you want to try this out, all you need is just a wallet address and the API key. So you can just paste your API key right here. And then you can paste your wallet address over here. So I'm just going to copy that. Yep. Once you have done that, you can also, uh, set the time frame and also the chain as well. So once you have done that, I'm just going to take this curl command and run this on my terminal. So you can basically see how it works. There we go. So now you can basically see the response contains the total count of trades. It also contains the total trade volume. It also contains the total realized profit percentage the total buys, the total sells, and you also have the bought volume and sold volume as well. So where this is exactly useful is if you're building like a wallet or a portfolio tracker or any DeFi or a DEX application, you have this data which is ready to go for you to directly display in your UI. And if you want to see where, uh, how this looks like in a real time production application, you can head over to morales.com and morales.com is like the ultimate DEX terminal. And if you go into the portfolio section, you can basically see like how Morales APIs powers this entire platform. And you can basically see the trading stats right here. So the trading stats show you like the realized profit and loss. You can see the total realized profit. You can see the total trades. And again, this is like, uh, shows you across the total days as well. So in the past 30 days, 60 days, 90 days, etc. And all the data you see on the right side as well is also coming from Morales APIs. So if you were to see the net worth by tokens or the net worth by chains, or if you want to get like the wallet transaction history or the NFTs, you can essentially use Morales APIs to do that. Just check out our YouTube channel and see our relevant tutorial on how you can get that uh, particular data using Morales APIs or just visit our docs as well to get that data. So now that we have covered the get wallet PNL summary, now let's go over the next one, which is get wallet PNL breakdown. Now, as you see right here, the PNL summary is like giving us the PNL summary for a wallet and it's not giving us for a specific token. However, if you want to get it for like a specific token, you can just head over to get wallet PNL breakdown. And over here, you can essentially select the chain and you can also filter by token addresses if you're interested. So I'm going to try this out and I'm going to put this on Ethereum. So let's basically copy this and go back here. There we go. Here you go. You can basically see the response and it basically shows you like the token address, which is the wrap data. It shows me the average buy price. It shows the average sell price, the total USD that's invested, the total tokens bought, the total tokens sold, etc. You also get like the uh, total buy sells and how much is the uh, average co cost of quantity sold, etc. 
and you can also see the logo of the token as well so whenever you're like showing the tokens on your portfolio dashboard or on your explorer you can essentially use the uh, dashboard to just show all of that data so coming to our uh, pnl breakdown so here you can basically see you get it like for every specific token in the wallet you get like the average usd uh, buy price average sell price the total usd invested you can also see the token name symbol logos etc and you can also filter this out by a specific token so essentially this will work on any chain that we support so if you just hit test live api you can even try it out from this docs page itself and it shows you like the result which contains the token and the buy price the sell price etc so that's essentially how you can use the wallet pnl apis in order to get like the profit and loss data for your application and if you enjoyed this video feel free to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so that you can stay tuned for all our further videos thank you